Bro, that was the biggest spider ever. Holy fuck. What is up guys? It's your boy Daz, AK Motor Bro, and today we are on the flipping Thumbstar 140cc pit bike. And I'm gonna give y'all 10 reasons why y'all need to get a flipping pit bike right now. But the trail's still going, bro. If the trail don't stop, I don't stop your feels. Who knows? We might end up at a pot of gold at the end of this. There might just be a pot of gold waiting for us. Bro, we're gonna end up on the other side of freaking the colony or something, bro. I've been going on this trail forever. But that's the cool thing, bro. On a pit bike, you literally just explore, bro. It's so fun to explore and just finding new areas. Wait, what? Bro, look at this. There is no way things cross this. Bro, you see what I'm talking about? I don't even know if this is freaking trustworthy, bro. I might fall in. See termites. See if I can put it on the kickstand. No fucking way. Don't fall. All right, let's get across. Let's get across this thing. <laughs> Try to get down there real quick. It's actually a lot easier across this than I expected man. I thought I was gonna ride across but it's a lot easier to push it. You see this right? Is this like a what is that? I smell fire out here. Oh fuck it's probably fire. <laughs> it's probably me. I was like, bro, I smell something burning. And it's probably the exhaust burning these leaves. Luckily, it's freaking humid as hell. And it ain't dry, so I ain't gonna start nothing. I wanna ride across this, but I'm a little scared. Maybe if y'all give me like 10k likes, I'll ride a, I'll wheelie across this thing. <laughs> Do something crazy. I think I can wheelie across it. I hope you guys enjoy the view of the front because I changed it from the side mount to the front mount. Bro, there's a, what? Look at this. Bro, this looks like a, a boar trap. 100% a boar trap. You know how I can tell? Because they put something right here, and when something triggers it, it drops down. <sighs> Find some weird stuff back here, bro. I'm getting some weird vibes now, bro. Bro, that was the biggest spider ever. Holy f Look at that thing! Holy sh! Holy sh! I don't know if y'all can see that, dude. Oh my god! Bro, y'all see that? Bro, that is a huge spider. And I almost ran into it, bro. I had to drop my bike and everything. I said, f that, I ain't not hitting it. Let me grab my sh. And we're getting the f out of here! Bro, I don't think I've seen a spider that big ever. Come on, baby. I fucking flooded it. Oh, we getting the out of here, bro. After seeing that, bro, I never seen a spider that big in my life. At least not wild. Holy. We're gonna be flying through. Oh, there's another one there! They're everywhere over here! 
it's like bro how many have i went through already without even knowing that's the scary part that's the freaking scary part bro there's a few things i'm scared of spiders snakes a little bit not really i'm more scared of spiders than snakes bro freaking spiders just they look scary man like bro that bitch was like at least as big as like when it stretches out it's probably big as my knuckle I swear I swear bruv yeah we're flying through so if they freaking if they hit me ah! they ain't gonna be sticking to me holding on for dear life bro I'm bouncing everywhere we're free holy crap that was a journey right there bro number one as you could probably tell this bike is perfect not just this bike but pit bikes in general are perfect to learn wheelies man they're small bikes they don't have too much power but they teach you all the basics you need to know on how to wheelie watch out for a snake but bro i don't know if y'all follow me on my snapchat but i was going through here the other day on my freaking pedal bike and i literally seen the biggest eastern diamondback bro in my life poisonous rattlesnake and it was just slithering right across it was huge bro that's the first time i've seen a rattlesnake that big in florida in the wild these pit bikes or just pit bikes in general are the best bikes to learn wheelies with number two it is also cheaper than getting a big bike these bikes are way cheaper and you can have just as much fun on this bike or a big bike it doesn't really matter they're both like the same thing i say when you're first starting out a pit bike is the best bike to get you already know what time it is bro we gotta hit a dd for the fam it's been too long Sloppy right there. <laughs> Not sure what happened right there. Like literally, oh look at that bird. I thought he was gonna try and scoot me, bro. It's crazy the amount of stuff you find on your pit bike bro when you're just exploring like your neighborhood and you find like a weird trail like this like what do you want birdie Ch trying to fight Oof. oh that was a bug in my freaking mouth but like bro like trails like this like i would have never came back here if i didn't have my pit bike bro like the things you find on a pit bike is madness bro that's a jump right there if I've seen one and it is bro but there are some downfalls of having a pit bike and it is they ain't the strongest that's for sure compared to a lot of other bikes especially if you get a Chinese pit bike and sorry that this isn't I'm taking all this stuff off my freaking leg right now but if you have a Chinese pit bike it definitely ain't the strongest the next reason is the community bro like the motorcycle community once you're in it and like once you're just freaking i don't know bro it's like i've met so many riders from just riding my freaking bike it's so insane like the amount of people i've met all across the world there's a freaking hunting thing right here bro the amount of people you meet from riding i've met people all around the u.s um all around europe bro it's so insane bro like i feel like anywhere i go i can meet riders like everywhere ah that was a thorn in my leg 
everywhere there's motorcycle riders and like the community is so nice and so general generous like i don't know i just haven't met many other communities where it's just like i don't know the it's, people are so nice bro in the bike life community like when i went to czech republic i've never met these two dudes before and they invite me for a weekend at like a supermoto house bro they rented a house out in czech republic you've probably seen the video we're riding in the mountains and bro it's just like it's so freaking cool Alrighty, guys i hope you enjoyed this video i hope this convinced you on why you should get a pit bike if this is your first bike and not even if it's not your first bike just a bike to have bro there's so much freaking fun remember to stay motivated i freaking love you we got new merch check it out motorbro.com link is in the description below and yeah love you gang Peace.